Hey guys, uh, welcome to Electro Labs. Um, according to our lab's chief, you need three basic things uh, to be part of the maker scene. Uh, one is like an outstanding working place. Second is you gotta grow a beard. So I'm in the process already. <laughs> and the third is you need an outstanding uh, and epic and evil and whatever job title. So I'm going for that, <laughs> which is really badass. Okay. <laughs> Okay, uh, basically, the guys at Relayer, uh, it's a startup in, uh, in Berlin. I think they, you know, they, they have all these, these uh, attitudes, these uh, qualities. As you probably know, they are the makers of the Wunderbar. Uh, we finally have uh, 10 or 12 of these uh, here in the labs. And, and well, basically, I just wanted to explain you what's, what's inside. And well, first of all, most probably also you may uh, identify a few familiar names here. Uh, for instance, we see the first thing we see is sponsored by Conrad. I'm sure that most of you know uh, already Conrad. Uh, second, it's designed and produced by Microelectronica. You know, also you probably uh, know their uh, development tools and stuff, uh, pretty famous. They uh, recently opened a factory in Hungary, if I'm not wrong. So most probably, and they take care of their production. Next thing we see is uh, Freescale enabled. So that means that the microcontrollers used here are uh, provided by Freescale. And another nice thing we see is uh, open source. So all designs are available in their website. All code is open. Everything is uh, as a true maker would do. First thing that <clears throat> catches our attention is, that, is the, the, the box, the boxing, the packaging. And well, these guys know a lot about engineering, but they also know a lot about marketing, I must say. Because look at, look at how the, the box looks like. It's really like a chocolate uh, box. It's amazing. Uh, we, when we were uh, in their uh, press conference like a uh, few months ago in Berlin, they gave us some goodies. And also another thing that is really, really nice and I think really groundbreaking for, you know, somehow sometimes boring electronics industry is the casing as you can see it looks like also like chocolate pieces and you can even um, split them you can even snap them and they also gave us some chocolate you know looks like a PCB really nice and of course you know part of the maker scene you don't wear suit you wear t-shirts <laughs> and I'm wearing one so <laughs> so Thanks guys for everything and let's see what's in the box. Okay, uh, the feeling we have is like we're opening, you know, like a Christmas toy or something like that. It even smells like, like that. And so the presentation is really good. Uh, we have some cards here written by Jackson Bond. Jackson is the, is the head of product of Relayer. Then, you know, it's like really easy to follow guides on how to start everything, how to connect everything step by step and some uh, configurations of the board and like a schematics or something showing all the all the stuff then of course of course stickers are also part of uh, maker stuff so we can stick them on our laptop and look at this i mean and now tell me it doesn't look nice it looks really really nice <laughs> okay so you just uh, pull out whoa and we find everything and here's the real casing because the one they showed us in the, in the press conference it was uh, 3D printed and this one is already like injected plastic or something it says ABS but looks really really nice really robust and second I mean like the second layer of the box uh, it's everything what's important uh, what's nice uh, this box also has like a special feature from my point of view which is they including the shortest Cable in the history of engineering. <laughs> this is a micro. Uh, sorry for the joke, guys. And this is a micro USB uh, USB uh, cable, so we can power the Bundabar really easy. And also, it includes uh, six. Uh, sorry, five five uh, coin cells. And these coin cells are going to to. Uh, I mean, we have to put them in every of the of these modules. So let's go for it. 
another, I mean, one important thing to note is that uh, before connecting or in order to make this thing work properly, you have to, to connect this small battery, uh, a lithium battery they are providing with the kit to the main module. So it's quite easy actually, it has like a socket there. So, okay, it's already blinking. And now, uh, as you can see, I'm using my laptop, but actually I'm not connecting the Wunderbar to, the, to my laptop. I'm just using this uh, in order to provide power. So you could use actually like a phone charger like this, a USB. But you know, the USB ports of the, of the laptop are convenient. And there we go. Okay, the concept of this board is that uh, we have like a main board, which is this one. Uh, the one uh, saying Wunderbar and this board is uh, connected to our home network via Wi-Fi and is communicating with the other uh, small boards, the other small devices which are for instance a temperature humidity sensor, a infrared transmitter, a microphone, an accelerometer, a light and proximity sensor and a bridge. A bridge uh, is, a, is a module we can use to connect other devices uh, we design or to control an Arduino or whatever we want. So these boards are communicating with the main board via uh, the famous BLE, it's Bluetooth Low Energy. So that means that we can place, for instance, a microphone module in another room in our house and, and it will be sending uh, this, all the signals to the main module and we can access the data uh, of this, I mean, we, we can uh, hear the sound, uh, whatever is happening in that room, using our smartphone, because our smartphone will be communicating with the main module uh, by Wi-Fi. The Bluetooth modules, as far as I know, are provided by Nordic, and uh, the main chip, which is here, is the, as we said, is a Freescale microcontroller, which looks like a BGA because it's uh, I don't see any pin here. Okay, in order to, to configure this, to get it running, uh, after connecting we have to download an app uh, provided by Relayer, uh, which is really straightforward and you know in, I think actually you can you can get it running in seconds. So as you can see here we have the app and Relayer. Once we configure the, the Wi-Fi and we name our, our Bunderbar because we can of course connect uh, several of these boards and work together with them at home or at the office or whenever, or whatever we want. Uh, as you can see, we can access the different uh, sensors and different stuff we have. For instance, we can check the temperature we have in this room or we can see, I mean, if there's uh, something going on uh, on this other room, or we can check uh, the light pro proximity sensor, which also provides um, uh, an approximate uh, the approximate color of, of light uh, it's detecting. So it works pretty fine. And once we're done with this, uh, the interesting thing is that development kit is uh, pretty complete. Although you might need some expertise or at least ex experience programming apps. But okay, it's, uh, everything is there. And uh, another funny thing of this kit, I must admit, is uh, that after, I mean, once we're done, we just uh, disconnect it. And now it's ready, to, it's ready to work. So we have to power all these modules, but we can dip them like chocolate. So. And there we go, and we just, uh, you know, dip the modules, and, and now they're ready to roll. So we just add the battery, so this is really convenient. For instance, I'm using the, the IR transmitter. Okay, and as you can see, the, this module is uh, already working. And then I just, take the, I just take the casing, I went for the IR transmitter. So it's here, and... Okay, ready to roll. And we just stick it here. And apparently the battery lasts like uh, months. I mean, almost like they, they say that a year. So, so you may forget about 
power this <laughs> again you can just place this for instance uh, close to your TV and control the TV via your smartphone you know so it's convenient so okay guys uh, I hope you you enjoy this uh, you know and uh, if you like this video for uh, weekly updates please subscribe here and see you next time bye bye